In Python, you can pass a function to another function as an argument. If we wanted to alphabetize this list of fruits, we could pass it to the built-in sorted function, except that it doesn't quite alphabetize it because all the lowercase letters come after all the uppercase letters in Python whenever you sort strings. In order to fix this, we could supply a key argument to the built-in sorted function. This key argument is supposed to be a function that will be called with each of the individual items in our fruits iterable, and it should return the thing to sort by. So in our case, we should make a function that lowercases any string that's given to it in order to sort by the lowercase versions of these strings. So we could call sorted not with just fruits, but with a key argument that points to this lowercase function. So now we have properly alphabetized our list of strings here. Now notice that when we called sorted, we didn't put parentheses after lowercase to call it. We didn't call lowercase at all. We instead just referred to it. We passed the lowercase function object in to the sorted function so that it could then call lowercase itself repeatedly on each of the individual items and fruits. So in Python, there are functions that accept other functions as arguments. That means that you can also make your own functions that accept a function as an argument. So we have a function here called get2, and if we import the random module and call get2 with the random.rand range and three, it will call random.rand range on three twice, giving us back a tuple of both of the things it got back. So it's randomly generating numbers uh, that are either zero, one, or two. So this get to function, it accepts a function as an argument. And the one thing that you can do with a function is call it. So it's just assuming that the func argument is in fact a function object or really any callable object, anything that it can call by putting parentheses after it and giving it one item. So in Python, you can pass function objects in to other functions. Functions can be passed around in Python. And in fact, you will see functions built into Python and in the Python standard library that expect functions to be given as one or more of their arguments so that they can then call them later.